Okay, here we are. As you can see, I have an um, 1947 to 1966 exhibit cello pack um, with Mickey Mantle on top. Awesome piece, except it has a huge, huge split in it, both on the front, you can see, and a huge split here on the back. It's already, like, coming up. So, I believe, yeah, there's five cards in here. Of course, we don't know who the back one is. Um, I does have, looks like it might be a little touch corner up here. I don't know if you can see. But, I thought, well, we might as well open it because I, it's so hard to sell something like this um, as an unopened pack. Um, most people probably wouldn't consider it unopened because there's so much damage to the cellophane itself. So we're going to go ahead and open it. And yeah, the Mickey Mantle, I'll be sending that to PSA. So anyway, let's see the back. It is kind of neat to see something like this. You know, you didn't see a lot of these come in packs. I mean, yeah, th there's quite a few packs, but, you know, mostly they saw them in the vending machines um, where you put in a penny and uh, you get a baseball card. Um, they also had Cowboys and Indians. They had actors. I believe they had football. So, all right. Anyway, let's open and see what we get. So, like I said, there is a very slight touch on that corner. I believe this card would come back in eight. So, that would be a great grade to get. So, let's see who else we get. Next card up. Another Yankee. Tony Kubek. And I'm not sure if that's the variation or not. I, I, there, there are some cards that have di more difficult pose variations. Um, I don't know if that Kubek is one or not. Anyway, cool card. Looks nice. Should be. <laughs> it's out of a pack. Next is Lindy McDaniel. Very nice. And the fourth card, Mickey Vernon. And let's see who we get for the very last card. Andy Pofko. Honestly, I don't know if I've ever seen that Pofko. So I'll have to check them out. I don't know if uh, that's the way the card was made or if that's just the way the, uh, the print porter is. It's interesting though, you see that white line going across. And it looks like, you know, the, the print is correct. But, and there's the empty cell. But, so, to review, we got Andy Pavko. Nice Mickey Vernon. Lindy McDaniel. That almost looks like around his rookie year, too. Looks very young in that picture. Tony Kubek. And the Mick. And one thing about... A lot of people get confused. Um, real exhibits versus the reprints. The original ones have this creamy color stock and the uh, fake ones either have like a real gray stock or a white stock so these are absolutely real but very nice alright thanks for watching